Hello everyone, so in this video I'm going to show you how you can host your website here using Cloudflare. So this is free, but in case you have a domain that you purchased from GoDaddy, let's say for example, or uh, whichever registrant uh, organization. Now here, this website right here, I purchased it from GoDaddy. So initially you need to add your domain right here in Cloudflare. Once you add your domain, you will be asked to change your DNS right here. For example, here in my uh, name server settings of this domain, which is in GoDaddy, will update your name servers based on what Cloudflare will give you when you add your new domain. So when you add the domain here, you select this manually enter DNS so that you will be able to enter this DNS here in your own domain settings. For example, externally GoDaddy or whichever registrant you are. Now after adding, you will see here in the website menu right here, your site will be active or pending status depends on how fast your DNS will be updated. When you, this is in active status, it means it's ready to be used. Now in order for us to host our site here in Cloudflare, so we will be using WordPress initially, and then we will export this because Cloudflare accepts assets. So here we will go to work and pages. And here you go to pages, we will be uploading our site here. So we only need to have HTML, CSS and JS so that we will be able to run our site here. Now, if our website is in WordPress, it's very easy to do. I'm going to show you the step. We will just need to export this and generate this as a static site. So for example, I am going to add, I am going to create my new website here. So my website will be uh, related to football, let's say. So here in keyword uh, tool, SEMrush, I am using this keyword magic tool to easily get my keywords. So I'll just type my seed keyword, which is football. And here I did some filters because, for example, this one, I want to exclude these keywords like today, 2024, 2023. I just want to gather those generic questions keywords. So I'm going to choose questions tab and I'm going to remove these keywords, which are having dates now. And also I am going to choose those keywords that are in very easy category. Now we will be exporting these keywords right away. You can also do this if you want to earn more money in your keywords. So for example, this one, where to buy Ohio State football tailgate. So as you can see here in the intent, it's marked as transactional. So user wants to do action. So it's indicated conversion. That means there's a higher chance that a person searching for this term will buy items. So here is a filter here where you can select just transactional, you apply that, and as you can see right here are 47 keywords where you can target and make them as, you know, your articles or topics. And all of these mostly are transactional, which higher chance of people searching for these terms will buy something. All right. But in this case, I'm just going to grab all this because I want to get traffic pretty fast. And to get traffic pretty fast, you have to publish multiple articles. So we're going to do that now. So I'm going to export these initial keywords that we found here in Keyword Magic Tool. Once you have exported your uh, elected keywords, just like here, so make sure you do some manual check whether these keywords are duplicating from each other. You can also ask ChatGPT or Claude to filter those duplicate keywords and just send you the unique list. You can do that as well. So in the purpose of this video, I'm going to select few articles here that I'm going to post to my WordPress so that I can export and generate a static website from my WordPress and then I'll upload that to Cloudflare. So let's copy this. Now head over to any generator tool. So in my case, I'm just going to use article AI generator. And then here in the generate bulk articles, I'm gonna just generate these articles right here. I'm gonna post it to my new WordPress site. So I will be selecting the site right here. Now, before I generate the bulk articles, make sure in your WordPress, in your new WordPress, you install the required plugin. So I'm gonna add, I'm gonna upload the plugin. So I'll browse it. So this basic auth master that zip, you will be able to download this plugin from here only. So you will see this link setup guide for automatic WordPress posting. So you select, you click that and you will get the plugin right there. Now we install this plugin and then we activate it. And that's it. No further configuration is required. Once you have this JSON basic authentication, you will be able to auto post your articles from article AI generator to your new WordPress site. So let's generate this new articles right here. And then we will uh, be exporting this WordPress site as static HTML. So we will be able to host it in Cloudflare. So it runs faster. So make sure you select auto post yes, and we publish them. And of course, we will generate bulk uh, featured image for these articles right here. Now let's generate this. Now while waiting for those articles to be generated, let's install another plugin. So we click this add new plugin right here, we will search this plugin right here static 
just like that. Just search this term, static, and this first result right here, simply static, we will install this. And then once it's installed, just activate it. And there you go, once it's activated, go to this menu right here, simply static. And now we can now generate all the static files, the entire site, so that it will be converted to HTML, CSS, and JavaScript only without the use of any database. And it will load faster when it's on the internet. Before that, let's see if our articles have been posted. See right here, all our 10 articles that we just recently generated from Article AI Generator have been completed. So let's take a look one of the articles. How many people on football team? Let's view that. You see right here, you got this beautiful AI generated image right here, which attracts readers to complete and go through your entire article right here. And this is the fully SEO optimized and comprehensive articles that's been produced by Article AI Generator. And it's eligible to rank on Google because it has all the features. Although it's AI generated, you can do optionally humanize these contents by going to some humanizer, for example, AI, AI bypass filter.com. You can humanize some of the paragraphs here, although it's completely optional. But if you are concerned of the AI contents, you can do that, but you can post it directly. As long as you're not spamming your site, then you're good to go and you're providing good content right here because we did a keyword research manually and we gathered those keywords that can make us rank pretty easy. Then I think we have a good chance here. And let's check the number of words. You see right here, we just selected short form article, but we're still able to generate 1,699 words. And if we select medium length articles, we will be able to generate 2,500 words above. So that's also one factor on ranking on Google. And one of the most important factors, guys, is having your site load really fast. So it's also an important factor nowadays because millions and billions of websites are using WordPress. And if your website is quite slow, then you, Google might choose not to index your page or not to put you on page one. So since all our articles have been generated, we are now ready to generate the static site. So let's click this generate right here and let's do this generate static files. And right here in the activity lab, you will see that it's completed. You just need to download the entire zip of the site. Once you have the zip file, again, you go to the main menu of your Cloudflare. So go to workers and pages right here. And here in the pages tab, you will see this upload assets. So let's upload the downloaded zip file of our WordPress site. So here you put the project name. So I'm just going to use the name of my domain. Then you click this create project. So here it will ask you again to upload your project assets. So again, let's grab the zip file. And there you go. All our assets have been uploaded. As you can see, they got extracted automatically. So what we need to do now is simply right here, deploy site. We can now connect if you, because we connected our own custom domain. So we will be able to use that as our uh, URL. So we click this add a custom domain. You will see right here, I, I am now using my custom domain that we added earlier. So you can see right here, this is now our website using this domain and it looks WordPress website, but it's actually a static site right here. Because as you know, we exported this site using static plugin and converted the website to just HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. They're not using big bases anymore. You can see here, we are now using our custom domain right here, and it's it's loading pretty fast. So the way you do that to connect your custom domain, so after you uploaded all the assets in work pages right here, here, as you can see right here, what you need to do is just come over here, just select your project, right? Just like that. Go to custom domains. And then here, since I already added, you just need to add this Sokolite24.com, the domain that we added earlier in the beginning of the video, and then follow the instruction that will be given. Usually what you just need to do, you just need to add C name. That's it. So to add the C name, you just need to go to websites and here, select your custom domain right here. And here we go to DNS records. So I was instructed to just add this C name right here, C name record that points to here. So you simply click this add record and then select C name right here. And then here, just copy the content that will be provided to you by from the instruction right there when you're adding a custom domain to your project. So just add this like that. Make sure there's no spaces. And here you just add the W and then save that. And you add one more record, same thing, C name, and then just add the root just like that. So you will have these two records right here. Then wait for a few minutes, maybe a maximum of 10, 15 minutes wait for it to propagate 
and you will be able to access your website right here using your domain hosted in Cloudflare. So this actually loads really fast, this website right here, because it's not using database anymore. So it's using purely HTML and JavaScript right here. So we go to home. So all this stuff, again, before you export, like what I told you, make sure you organize, you fix everything, you add your logo and color and things like that. All right. Uh, that's about it, guys. And I hope you learned something from this one. And if you do, please don't forget to leave a like. See you in the next one.